Good evening, Chavez family. Thank you for joining us this evening for our first ever virtual dance concert entitled Frame. Frame this evening will be a dance film experience. So rather than seeing dance expressed here live on the stage, you'll see dance expressed through film. It's been a great opportunity, a great quarter working with the students and teaching them how to express through film. It's been challenging, but it has been a great experience. I do want to acknowledge our guest artist, Angel Castro. He does have a feature piece this evening, and I'm very grateful that my students got the opportunity to work with him. I do want to take time to acknowledge and thank our principal, Mr. Matthew Georgia, and our administrative team. I want to thank our security staff and our maintenance for helping us make this happen. We worked on this project for the most part virtually, but with safety protocols, we were able to meet in person the last few weeks to come together um, with safety protocols and come together and rehearse and do the filming. So um, what you will see tonight, as I mentioned, was a piece from Angel Castro, as well as myself, and as well as student work that was produced from home. Thank you again for joining us. So for now, sit back and relax and enjoy Frame.
explaining my depression to my mother a conversation. Mom, my depression is a shapeshifter. One day it is as small as a firefly in the palm of a bear. The next it's the bear. On those days I play dead until the bear leaves me alone. I call the bad days the dark days. Mom says try lighting candles. When I see a candle, I see the flesh of a church. The flicker of a flame, sparks of a memory younger than noon. I am standing beside her open casket. It is the moment I learn every person I ever come to know will someday die. Besides, Mom, I'm not afraid of the dark. Perhaps that's part of the problem. Mom says I thought the problem was that you can't get out of bed. I can't. Anxiety holds me a hostage inside of my house, inside of my head. Mom says, where did anxiety come from? Anxiety is the cousin visiting from out of town. Depression felt obligated to bring to the party. Mom, I am the party. Only I am a party I don't want to be at. Mom says, why don't you try going to actual parties? See your friends. Sure, I make plans. I make plans, but I don't want to go. I make plans because I know I should want to go. I know sometimes I would have wanted to go. It's just not that much fun having fun when you don't want to have fun, Mom. You see, Mom, each night, insomnia sweeps me up in his arms, dips me in the kitchen in the small glow of the stove light. Insomnia has this romantic way of making the moon feel like perfect company. Mom says try counting sheep, but my mind can only count reasons to stay awake, so I go for walks. But my stuttering kneecaps clank like silver spoons held in strong arms with loose wrists. They ring in my ears like clumsy church bells, reminding me I am sleepwalking on an ocean of happiness I cannot baptize myself in. Mom says happy is a decision, but my happy is as hollow as a pinpricked egg. My happy is a high fever that will break. Mom says I am so good at making something out of nothing and then flat out asks me if I am afraid of dying. No, I am afraid of living. Thank you. 